Okay, so now I think I uh, we can continue. I I glued these on. And this is now uh, dry. So, uh, what I did in the meantime, I distressed all the white just a little bit so that it doesn't stand out so much. You see the difference now? It's just slightly distressed. Um, so let's finish this little uh, tutorial. Um, I, I did some embellishments in the meantime and um, I cut out this border with eggs and glued on to um, this side and you can still see um, through this then I made something um, I cut out these little uh, postcards and then I cut a slice in it so that it um, is actually a little pocket and then I cut out some of the eggs um, so that's just a little fun idea on this page I decided I want to have this label and then uh, the forget me not here so that's I'm um, that's I'm going to glue it down now and this is just to give you a couple of ideas how you can embellish uh, a little journal like this um, you don't have to do this but uh, I think it's a fun little idea then I cut out some of the jumbo tags and um, punched out um, some um, scalloped circles for grabbing and then I just distressed the back side uh, for the pocket here uh, on this um, I cut out a few scraps to make small pockets over here you see um, and then some tags on this side I also cut out a, a little postcard and then I sewed to, uh, two tags together and then you can tuck them in here in this little pocket on this page I want to embellish on the top with this these two punches and then I wanted to show you how I did this I cut out a little postcard and then on the back side I used some masking tape uh, and then cut a slice with my exacto knife, craft knife and then I'm simply going to use so and I'm putting it down here and then we have the little pocket for tags and and stuff so and this I'm going to uh, glue down with my hot glue gun Placing it there, and then I'm going to use a button as dimension, I think. Yeah, so I'm putting down this little button there, and then This is a simple cutout from one of the scraps, so everything gets used, nothing is wasted. And then I'm going to put glue down um, an old button 
on top of it. And it's actually a recycled button. It was in a shirt at some point. So, uh, okay, so there we have it. Just a small embellishment. Um, this we also finished. This is dry and the tags are in. Then we're moving on. Then I'm going to do the same here. And then a button on top. And I'm covering the butterfly. Oh man. I didn't think about that. But never mind. Um and also here I have the same same thing with a postcard, cut a slice and then glue two eggs together and put down on this one. On this page, I thought about, and this is now, it's actually a little bit too thick for my taste. I wanted to um, glue some flower punches just for a little bit of embellishing here on the doily. going to do that anyway but I'm not going to use buttons and once it's dry well we can lift up the petals a little bit um, So, that's just an idea. I think it's okay. It's dry now. So, so on this uh, last page, I did some preparations. Um, I cut out this, and now I'm planning on putting this little pocket here, embellish it with these punches and then use this as a pocket as well as a top loaded so I prepared that so we're going to adhere this now and then we're almost done and I think this video is going to be the longest I have made um, it's been taking me all day to do it. It's been fun, but hard. <laughs> I will not um, lie about that. Um, no, I don't want to glue this. I'm going to use the double-sided tape. Oh, let's get this and there we have it and finally this little embellishment and if one takes a closer look one can see it's actually a rose it's very difficult to see I'll admit that, but I can see it, so I'm telling you. So, now 
this this is almost finished now so the back side I also decorated I have two layers on it now and then I have cut out some of these beautiful blue flowers and then I'm going to glue it on here and I'm using a button as dimension so let's have it down here first the button how it's hot it's very hot so some more glue and then the flowers oof this is not so good now I have it all over my hands so So you can just move it around until it dries and I'm going to um, glue this too otherwise it's going to tear and we don't want that. So the delicate flowers There you have it. Um, I was also going to um, get these flowers here and I am going to give them a twist. Whoops. And then glue them down. Okay, so this is how you can do it with just yeah, two envelopes and some beautiful papers. Um, I hope you enjoyed it and I, I really, really hope that you um, are making one of these of your own. Um, maybe you know somebody out there who would really enjoy a little journal like this. Um, you know, if you if you use some more life quotes or love quotes or something like that, you could really, really touch someone's heart with it. See, this is just so beautiful. You could put all kinds of ephemera here, um, beautiful tags, and yeah, I think it's. A wonderful idea. Um, so I hope you liked it and even if they're kind of the same they're also very different so that's just uh, your uh, opportunity to um, personalize it and um, make one of these of your own. So.